So these are the diaries of a goat farmer. So these are uh, our winners. So these are the winners, you can see them. So these are our winners. You can see that uh, they are growing well. So no longer any milk and these are all F1. So we are giving them lucen and they are going uh, grazing. So they seem to be doing well. Yeah, so they're doing well as you can see. So this is the multiplication effect of goats. So all these that you are seeing in there, uh, except for the back, uh, but all these that you're seeing in there, all these are profits. All those are profits. Uh, this one is, a, is, 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 is the profit because all these kids were not there um, four months ago. So when we started, we had a similar number of kids. And uh, within one year, uh, we, these are the profits. And you know what? They've actually multiplied in that uh, all of our goats, we had one is to one. So they actually just multiplied and actually gave us uh, back our investment. And this is our pure dough. So we... Remember when we started, we had a pure bag and a pure door. So the pure door gave us these uh, two. So this is one. This is another door. Uh, and uh, this kid has also got, uh, they came twins. So there's also another bag. So already in one year, you can see that uh, even our pure door and pure door, they actually replaced themselves. So these are now the profits. And this year, they are going to actually give us more. But but she looks nice. She looks good. She looks healthy. Um, you know, there's just that lump there, but it's nothing. We are not worried about it. It's coming down, I think, some sort of mineral deficiency, which we are correcting. But, uh, yeah, so she looks good. She's coming close to the camera. And, um, you know, this one is only just about three months now and um, she's growing quite well so all these that you can see now the mothers are coming back can you hear that sound the pandemonium so they're now waiting to look at their mothers remember when we wean them off we like them to be socially connected so they can see their mothers but they can't breastfeed and now it's been i think one or two weeks two weeks now without breast milk so they are now used to it but you know your ma they still they, they still want to see their mothers so as the mothers are coming back you can see they are lining up they uh, each one looking at at the mother and then the mother is also looking at the kids so that's our pure girl coming in there and as you can see um those are the mothers that gave us all these kids that you can see. So their number, the numbers are almost the same. So it means in one year, we've managed to double our numbers. And now, all the kids are now going to graze. Can you see now, these are all our profits now. They're going now. So they're going to graze. <laughs> So I'm just going to walk up uh, and just see how they are performing there. So this is the good thing about gold farming. You, Once you start, you notice that uh, they give birth. And when they give birth, you know, it, it's a project that uh, it, it can actually easily, you can actually easily re recoup your funds. So can you see the... The kids and the back. So the kids are browsing. I mean, that natural instinct is coming through. And for us, we, 
we like to do this we like to actually combine uh, browsing grazing and supplement the feed when we started and we were just giving them feeds every day uh, we didn't get good results we had so many illnesses so many died but now that we let them graze and then come and stop them up it's working well for us so let's look at the new ones so these are uh, the new arrivals so these came before we had wanted them to come so you can see we are feeding lucent uh, to the mothers um, and all of the kids they're looking they're looking healthy so this is our maternity section guys so it's been working for us so the kids are not allowed to live here and you can actually see uh, within the first month they don't actually leave this place they, they are not even adventurous but as they get older they start jumping over the the fence Yeah, so it's important to just make sure that it's clean. Can you see how clean this place looks? Um, that's the most important thing. You know, it just needs to be clean. Uh, and then the dry season is very good also as well. But cleanliness is so important. So these are the diaries of a goat farm. So the ones we wind off are there. I think you can see them. So those are the ones we've weaned off. Can you see them? Uh, so those are our winners. So they are three months and about two weeks, I think. Because they're, they're in the body, yeah, three months and... So they're just... They're just grazing. So we prefer to use the system where uh, they actually, we do semi-intensive where we feed them and then we also allow them to, to graze. It seems to be working well for us. So all these are F1 winners. I think we have one or two pure ones in there. But uh, so these are the diaries of a gold farmer. So a few months ago these were locked up in the maternity section like the one I showed you earlier but now uh, they're actually able to, to just browse and graze by themselves. It's interesting that the F1s like to move by themselves and then the pure uh, will look for where they are. They seem to want to spend a lot of time with the, with the pure buck. So these are the diaries of a goat farmer. So we thank God that this seems to be working. Let me just get closer so that you can see our our F ones. So let me get closer. So I don't know where it's cut this tree, but anyway, they seem to be liking to eat the, the leaves there. So after they eat like this, um, it's just important to make sure that there is clean water. So when they eat a lot of roughage and all the food that we give them, we make sure that there is always clean water uh, for them to eat. So this is very 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 important 
So I think, yeah, these are just some of the important tips and that I just wanted to share with you. So soon we're going to be selling these, these F1 bucks. And uh, I'll show you the next video what they look like at four months, five months. And I think, yeah, we'll be ready to sell at six. Thank you for watching. These are the diaries of a gold farmer.